Let's give them a nice hand, everybody. Here they come, 62 years. Bravo. I'll come down the yeah, bottom so you don't have to walk up these steps. Mm -hmm. Take your time. Nice and slowly. Very good. 62 years. And there's two ladies following them. I'm guessing that's... Is that the daughter? It is. Very good. All right, so you just you? come around here. Take your time. That's it. We'll come down the bottom and meet you. So if you're coming up here, I hope you can see up in the balcony. Hi. Can you make it up here? You can. I mind the step. Give me your hand. Just squeeze through the gap there. Very good. Take your time. I've got you. One more. One more. All right. Let me... You could, are you all right? Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at... Oh, wow. You... Uh, uh, couldn't help me up, could you? Thank you very much. <laughs> Come over here with me, sweetheart. 62 years. Look at this. Come and stand on my good side, young man. There we are. Let's introduce you to this lovely lady. What's your name? Lavon. Lavon. Uh, your last name is? Shelley. Lavon Shelley. Where are you from, Lavon? Utah. 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 Pardon? Of the United States. Oh, okay. Case, is, yeah, it could have been the one in Luxembourg. That's all right. We got you. Utah, beautiful place. And this is? Duff. What is it? Duff. Duff, like the bird? Duff, like a hat. A golfer. Duff. D-U-F-F. -F. Is that your real name or is that a nickname? Nickname. And your real name is? Merlin. Merlin. <laughs> wow. Merlin. So how does one get Duff from Merlin? I don't know. I've had it since I was five. Since you were five? Somebody said it's Duff and it just... Have you any idea what they call him that? He got named because he always wore a little Duffer ball hat from the time he was five. And they call you Duff. I didn't know his name was Merlin until we, I married him. <laughs> <laughs> doing your wedding vows and the, the, the priest whoever says uh, 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 will you take this man Merlin and you're going who the heck is Merlin <laughs> so uh, let's go back now uh, before even you were married more than 62 years ago let's go back a, a few more years do you remember the very first time you saw Duff the very first time you ever said oh, do you remember where you were and what you were doing yeah what was happening I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> you can whisper. We were at a carnival, you know, what do you call it? Amusement park. Like an amusement park. I was introduced to him, to him to me by a friend that knew us both. So the friend said, I know this beautiful lady and I know this handsome man and I think they would be together. And you were at the carnival and that's when you saw her. And would you say it was love at first sight? No. <laughs> very, very obvious. It's just no. Now, were, were you, uh, were, you, were you seeing someone else at the time? I took a girlfriend home that night. You took a girlfriend home. Do you remember who that was? Yes, my best friend. Oh. So, what did she, why did you go home with the best friend? I don't know, my friend, my best friend took her home. It's a very tight-knit community in Utah, <laughs> isn't it? So, you were with his best friend and you were with her best friend, but at some point you realized that he wasn't good for you and she wasn't good for you, and you dumped them both and ended up together. We switched the next, next uh, carnival. We oh, the next carnival, it's like a... Sort of an annual tradition, was it? <laughs> I see. So, here you are. You've been married for 62 years and you both look fantastic. Um, let me ask you a question from a lady's point of view. All these ladies on there on the road to marriage, what's the secret from a, a lady's point of view? Any advice you can give the girls out there? Don't ever try to change your husband because they don't. don't. Don't try and change them. Look at the man, look at the man, yeah, yeah. Hear that, honey? 
Wow, you just got your step. scented candles. We hate scatter cushions. Any advice? I hate scatter cushions. Mm -hmm. I had a beautiful chair at home and I went home on vacation. My wife had put a scatter cushion on it. What's your advice for the men? I don't know. Take them as they are. Take, so same for them. Don't change her either. No. It won't, Who's, it won't do you any good. It won't do you any good. Who's the boss? She is. She is. Now the ladies are. Has she always been the boss? What? Has she always been the boss? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> so is he still romantic? Oh, very. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know we sold that on board. Did you bring your own? <laughs> what did he say? Sorry, I can't tell you. Hmm? I want to sing you a little song. You want to sing me a little song? Is it for her? Yeah. Okay. I can't sing it. Any chance of hearing the second verse? <laughs> Can you remember it? to worry. It never pays to fret. If you lose or win, always wear a grin. Now all you get from worry is wrinkles on your brow. I've found a way to live long, so let me tell you how. If your bankroll is spent, laugh it off. If they call for the rent, laugh it off. If a feller borrows ten and you loan it to him then, all you can do is whistle till we meet again. If your income taxes do, laugh it off. If, if you're in bed with the flu, laugh it off. Your son wakes you up with a shout, take me on my paper route, laugh it off. Oh, brother, laugh it off. If your hair is falling out, laugh it off. <laughs> if you're getting big and stout, laugh it off. If the world looks bleak to you, Think of this because it's true. Graveyards are full of guys who'd gladly trade with you. <laughs> if you feel on the bum, laugh it off. If you <laughs> sit on chewing gum, laugh it off. <laughs> if, the <laughs> if your wifey runs away and they bring her back next day, <laughs> laugh it off. Oh, brother, laugh it off. <laughs> I guess you're going then. <laughs> mind the step there, please mind that bit of marble. Um, I don't know what to say. Laugh it off. We'll, we'll talk about that at the end of this little thing. But uh, um, I, I don't know. Duffy, that was just fantastic. It really was. Really, really was. And wonderful advice. Now... As I have a, a, a memory like Swiss cheese, meaning full of holes, is that your daughter? Yeah, would you, um, uh, when you finish, would you just drop me their name and a little bit of paper, the cabin number at the guest services desk? Because these people want to send you loads of stuff to your cabin for making us realize how important laughing is. So we're going to send you some goodies later, okay? Thank you. So